Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today I'm going to do a hands on demo of Semi Restore 11, also known as Rolectra, but whatever you choose to call it, this is the official unjailbreak tool released by the Electra jailbreak team, and in this video, we're going to try it out. All right, so before we start, give this video a huge thumbs up if you're stoked to have this official tool be released to unjailbreak your devices. Also hit that subscribe button to stay on top of the latest jailbreaking news, such as the release of Silio. And lastly, check out the description below for links to more information. So a bit of background about this tool. Well, it was developed by pwn to own one of the official Electra Jailbreak team members. And in theory, this is going to be used to completely unjailbreak our devices. Now, if you guys remember, a tool called Semi Restore 11 Lite was released with the first iOS 11 to 11.1.2 .1 Electra Jailbreak. Now, this tool removed all the tweaks installed, but did not remove Cydia. Thus, we then had to use a third-party script called Delectra to completely uninstall Cydia and the Electra Jailbreak. Well, now in theory, both of these tools are combined into one called Semi Restore 11 or Rolectra. I guess they couldn't decide on which name to officially call it, thus they threw both in. Anyway, I've yet to actually use this tool on my device yet, so in this video, you're going to see live what exactly happens when using it. Now, in theory, this should remove all of our tweaks and uninstall Cydia, but if you guys saw my latest jailbreak update video in which we talked about Cyleo, the new package installer coming to the Electra jailbreak very soon, it may actually be the case that this Semi Restore 11 tool is going to be used to transition us to that. So if that's the case, this tool may actually save our packages and settings and only uninstall Cydia. If that is the case, I will show you guys how to additionally remove all your tweaks and packages as well. But let's just get into today's video testing out Semi Restore 11 and see exactly what it does. So this official package is found on the Pack IX repo. So if we just head to sources, head Pack IX, head to all packages, and then navigate down to Semi Restore 11 slash Rolectra, all we have to do here is click modify up in the top right and click install. Now, not to fear, if you begin installing and it just freezes here and no progress happens, that is because the Pack IX repo has been up and down all day. They have been experiencing some technical difficulties on their end, so if you guys get to this part and are just stuck here, you're going to have to wait a couple hours, maybe try back tomorrow, and see if their official repo has been up and is back online for you to download this package. So again, if you're getting stuck, just check Pwn to owns Twitter account maybe to see if the Pack IX repo is experiencing any technical difficulties but if all goes according to plan it should look something like this you click modify you click install and then the package will begin to download you don't even have to do a respring you can just exit out of Cydia and as you guys can see the Rolectra or semi restore 11 application is right here on the home screen so we're gonna go ahead and open it up and as you guys can see it's a pretty simplistic design there is one button and that is to unjailbreak our devices but as you guys can see at the top it says revert all changes for a stock iOS and then of course it's by pwn to own one of the official Electra jailbreak members and right below on jailbreak it says for all Electra devices now while I was waiting for the pack IX repo to come back online I did a bit of investigating to see exactly how this tool works and what it does now when you click this on jailbreak button is actually going to erase all contents and settings of your device and set you back up on a fresh copy of iOS 11.3, 11.3.1 .3, or 11.4 beta 3, whichever version you are currently running. So Rolectra is actually going to do three things. One, it's going to erase all of your tweaks and packages that you have installed. Secondly, it's going to erase Cydia as well as the entirety of the Electra jailbreak. But third, what I didn't take into consideration, it's actually going to erase the device entirely, meaning all of your games, apps, and personal data. So before you do this process, I would highly recommend to create a backup of your phone just in case anything goes wrong so you don't lose any personal data. All right, so real quickly, I wanted to show you guys that in this video, I'm using my iPhone 10 for this demo. I was originally going to use my iPhone 6, but somehow I managed to get Rolectra to actually download from the Pack IX repo, even though it's experiencing all of these problems. So again, just a little bit about this device. It's on iOS 11.4 beta 3. I have about 37 packages installed in Cydia, and as you guys can see, I have quite a few applications installed directly from the App Store. 
Now in theory, this is going to remove everything. All right, so now I'm gonna head back into Rolextra and click Unjailbreak, and we're gonna go through the Unjailbreak process. Now I'm just going to leave this video uncut so you guys can see how long this Unjailbreak process will take. And if I run into any problems, I know some people are experiencing some boot loops, but it sounds like it's going to be a very easy fix, nothing to be afraid of. So again, I will take the plunge and see exactly how this utility works firsthand, and hopefully everything will go all right. All right, so the moment of truth, guys. It looks like my device has finished up. There was no need for a force restart at any point. It went straight through, so I either got very lucky or this tool actually does work really well. But as you guys can see, we are on the initial splash screen and setup page of stock iOS. We're just going to go through all the settings again. All right, so the only page that I wanted to take a pause on was this one right here when you have the option to restore from a backup either with iTunes or iCloud move your data from Android, or set up as a new phone. Now, if you're intending on jailbreaking again, either with Cydia once more or with Cilio once it comes out, you're going to want to set up your device as a new phone and re-enter your iCloud information and all of that once more. But the only way to really ensure that you are on the freshest version of iOS is to set everything up from scratch once more. I can say from first-hand experience that when I restored from a backup on my iPhone 10, the jailbreak really did not work at all. It was next impossible to re-enable the jailbreak for whatever reason. So again, I highly advise to set your phone up from scratch. All right, and here's the moment of truth, guys. We are going to the home screen, and I just, yeah, we're still on a beta, so that's good. Um, I'm just going to go to general about and show you guys I actually am on 11.4 still. But as you guys can see, Literally everything has been removed, all of my apps, all of my data. We are back on stock iOS once more. No Electra, no tweaks. Again, I'm going to read jailbreak real fast just to see if it saved any of information on that side of things, but I'll be right back to show you guys that. All right, so here we are back jailbroken once more on the iPhone 10 on 11.4 beta 3. If I take it out of airplane mode and reload the data with Insidia, as you guys can see, we are back with Insidia, but there are none of my previous tweaks installed. Everything has been removed from my apps to my tweaks to all of my personal data. Again, this literally reset everything. Even my sources have been reset back to the default sources that come when initially jailbreaking. Anyway, guys, I hope this video helped out on how to unjailbreak and reset your devices back to stock iOS with Rolectra slash Semi Restore 11. If you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. And if you guys want to stay updated on the latest jailbreaking news, don't forget to subscribe. 
Again, there is a full article written on best tech info down in the description of this video if you guys would like a written tutorial of this process. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching, but until next time, this is Tony, signing out.